Hi guys, this is another tutorial for its smart physics problem and this one is the LC circuit and it's asking us about what is the Q max on this capacitor so you can see this is a simple circuit that has inductor and capacitor and they gave us the information about it and they gave us that the in instantaneous current at time equal zero was 75 milliampere okay and they told us that the total energy stored like the stored electric and magnetic energies are equal to one another at that time time equals zero okay so what, <clears throat> how come that help us so we say that the potential is equal to the sum of the potential of the capacitor plus the potential of the inductor but since they are both equal to each other and we have the we have this one the potential energy of the inductor which is half i squared l then we can just multiply it by two this one is like Q squared over 2C at that time, QT, and the maximum potential energy is Q squared 2C, and this is max, Q squared max. By the way, you can see the question, the full question down in the description. Anyway, uh, okay, so Q max over 2C equal I squared L. Take the 2C, multiply it by the other side. So Q max equal to 2C I squared L, and take the square root of that. It's very important to make sure you do this correctly. It won't give you that you have a power error because it's the square root, and it will mess up if you have like 10 to the power error. So make sure you put these correctly. Uh, my answer was 1.537 times 10 to the negative 5. Just to give you an idea, this was in Coulomb because we're looking at current, looking at charge. Alright, I hope this helps and good luck.